One other special cause will still be around Sunday at the festival. Digging deeper, we found the Carnes Brothers, who own a parking lot a few blocks away from the festival. For $10 or a donation, drivers can park in the lot. The proceeds are all going back into the community, most of it to Good Sam. Last March, Mark Karen's heart stopped at Good Sam's. He passed out and woke up to nurses pumping against his chest to bring him back. Mark is a survivor now. His family wanted to give back. That's why his brother drove all the way from Florida to help man the fort. Mark says he hopes to give back to all his doctors and nurses that cared for him in the most crucial time. We're not keeping a dime. We're not keeping a dime. This is a this is payback for me. We're just local boys, uh, like people, and we don't get all caught up in corporation games and everything. Got to have corporations, but I tell you. When it all comes down to it, it's nice being uh, people oriented and just doing it person to person, people to people, one at a time, one at a time. Last I spoke with the Karens brothers, they told me they've already made $700, 100 of which has gone to their old school in Troy, St. Pat's. They hope to make a $1,000 donation to Good Sam by the end of the weekend. Beershell Edmay, 2 News, working for you.